again, KC9UNS here, uh, showing you my 10 meter dipole here in the uh, mobile home park. I got the tree. Uh, they got the dipole uh, running, there's this camouflage rope up around the little peg right there. I don't know if you can see it. Yeah, around there. Goes up in the tree about 15, 18 feet all the way up there. You see the line running across to, uh, oh, there it is, box right there. That's a Radio Shack, Radio Shack project box. Um, and with uh, two uh, eye hooks on that side over there, there is outlet. Uh, one of those outlet shields that uh, use for outlets. I don't know if you can see that. You can see a little bit. But that's uh, what I used for the insulator for both ends. There's a project box again. You can see it, it's tiny. And then, uh, yeah, watch out, barefoot here. There's the, the other insulator. It goes in the tree over here, down the line. And, uh, around here and uh, wrapped up around the tree kind of half-assed but what can you do for uh, that it's about 18 feet ish say it's well about 18 feet about that sorry about the wind I took down my uh, feed line for uh, not feed, the coax and added some more my Antron. It's my Antron. And there's my two meter. The Antron is on the left. The uh, two meter is on the right. Two meter 440. It's a Wilson, uh, not Wilson, Workman uh, antenna. I got from uh, KB9VR Jim. Really good guy. He gave it to me. There's a feat to get it to the house because. Uh, you can't take it apart except for the radials. But I uh, got it home, nice, safe. Almost attached to the ground. These are uh, uh, lie up poles, lay up poles, excuse me. Um, about 18 feet. That one's a little bit more in the Antron because it's, I didn't have an extra pole so I had to attach it to the house. And then uh, it's up there but it's not connected because I took it down for the dipole. This is a homemade dipole. Uh, wrapped around the extra feed lines wrapped around the stairs there down at the bottom and uh, this is uh, RG58 for the feed line going across and uh, inside the house because I didn't want to run the line back inside that is uh, 8x or G8x U I think I'm not quite sure it's a stuff that most uh, most people use for 10 meters but uh, and that uh, the, for the 2 meter 440, that's uh, RG213. So that's my uh, 10 meter dipole, homemade 10 meter dipole with the Radio Shack uh, project box that I was planning to use for something else, but I decided to make a dipole out of it and whatnot. And uh, Works uh, pretty good. Totally flat first time. Didn't even have to tune it. Put it up in the air uh, as temporary. Went inside and made a QSO with a, a 1010 member. Uh, what was it? N6OPR or something like that. I don't remember. But uh, I gotta get inside. Storm's coming, as you can see, and the wind's blowing. So thanks for watching. Uh, this is KC9UNS, Ben, Maryville, Indiana.